my name is Dr. Richmond Lowe and I'm the fish vet. Today we're presented with an axolotl. Her name is Axel Rose and she's since moving her from a terracotta tank to this 90 litre cement tank, she's lost her appetite and that's happened about four weeks ago and all she's eaten since then are three little amounts of worms. So we're gonna check out the water quality and check out her for parasites and anything like that that might be putting her off her appetite. So we've done our water quality testing. One of the main things where that axolotls lose their appetite, usually it's due to water quality issues. So it may be to do with the water temperature. Now it's approaching summer. If the water temperature is anything above 23 degrees, they'll start to stress out a little bit because these are Mexican walking fish. So they essentially they live in the rivers in Mexico and they receive water from snow melt so they really really like cool water. The water temperature here at the moment is between 18 to 20 degrees Celsius so that's perfect conditions for her. Um, the other reason why axolotls go off their food is to do with the filtration system. So if there's inadequate filtration the ammonia and nitrite might go up and if there's not sufficient water change activity happening in the daily or weekly maintenance, you can get nitrate, uh, high nit levels of nitrate that would cause stress to them. Additionally, if you've got a creature such as this little guy, uh, if they're, they're carnivorous, so if you're feeding them a lot, you're not doing your proper maintenance, what can happen is that your pH levels can also drop dangerously. So. We've checked the water quality parameters, the ammonia, nitrite, pH, and water temperature are all perfect. We've also tested skin mucus scrape from Axel Rod, and basically she has a clean bill of health. So it must be something to do with the move from her old tank to the new one. Uh, it's making her a little bit more stressed and go off her feet. So it's nothing to do with its environment in terms of the water quality. So. Our treatment regimen we're, we'll be giving her would be a combination of an appetite stimulant, some anabolic steroids, we're going to add vitamin C to the water and also multivitamins into the water as well. In terms of the medicines, we're going to give Axelrods about 0.1 milligram per kilogram body weight of dexamethasone as an appetite stimulant. We're going to give her 6 milligrams per kilogram body weight of stanabolic Stanozolol, and a, it's an anabolic steroid. Vitamin B complex, I'm going to give her about 0.1 mil per kilogram body weight. Now she weighs about 201 grams, so we're going to give that as an initial action, uh, initial course of action to see whether she'll respond to that and if we need to do any further diagnostics. Here we are with Axel. I think she knows what's uh, coming for her because she's now hiding under the bridge. Let me see that. Ease her into the net. These guys are very slippery, as, as slippery as eels and Siamese spiny fish, so always a good idea to handle them in the net. So it's going to use the first one is dexamethasone. So just lift her up a little bit above the water, give it into the patsil muscles. And next one is anabolic steroids. Again, just giving into the paxial muscles. Just waiting for her to stay still. Okay, and she can, we can return her back to her home. Let her put the bridge back where she likes it. <laughs> So the plan now is for uh, the owner to be feeding her 
trying different times of the day if we can and just try to treat her with different foods so earthworms that have been had sand removed so you keep the earthworm for about a few hours from fresh so that the worm is able to evacuate any sand that's in them uh, maybe some of the ox heart and any insects and things like that anything that would tempt her to eat other things you can try would be prawns and fish fillets and yeah, other insect larvae as well Within a week of treatment, I received a message from the owner saying that Axel Rose's appetite has returned and she's eating once or twice a day now. So that's all from me and Axel Rod. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe to get updates of our future videos and have a fantastic week.